All right, guys, what is up? It is January 1st, first day of the new year, 2015. Sitting out here, sitting outside of LA Fitness, about to use some guest passes here with Nino. Whoa, whoa, the young Nino is in the house. What's up? Just chilling with Thomas. We're getting ready to fucking show these people how to do a real workout. Son. Okay, yeah. Get out of there. So, so we have some guest passes because we're not members or anything. Right. Yeah, and I'm not with Carlos. We're this gonna time. see if they're good enough for us. Yeah, Fuck that's, that. yeah. that's what Nino said. He's, yeah. He said it's not whether we're going to join or not. It's whether they're good enough that's for us right, to join. That's right. Quality. So, <laughs> so what? Uh, wow. <laughs> so, anyways, yeah. Anyways, we're gonna go in here, work out, and then we're gonna go eat. So, that is the plan, boys and girls. Guys, anyway, um, there's like obliques and like, like, what is it? I can't even think right now. I forgot. Anyways, we just finished working out at LA Fitness. What did you think, Nino? Did it up past your standards? Not my standards. It was pretty, uh, like what Thomas said, it was a little bit too relaxing. I feel like if you go in there, you've got to go zero to 100 real quick. Yeah, dude, like, <laughs> after, after going to LA Fitness, like, oh, shit. Ugh. I don't like LA Fitness. I like 24 hour fitness better. I ain't got no type unless it's LA Fitness. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. Nah, so. and plus, plus the girl, the, the girl in the front, she was being kind of rude. Oh yeah, the girl at the front was yeah, like, she was, she was like just having an attitude, you know. Yeah, she didn't seem like she had a, she yeah. didn't seem like she had a good day, you know. Which which says a lot I about think, the employment there. So if she doesn't like working there, it must not be good to work out there. I like, uh, I think I'm a 24 hour fitness, so yeah, I'm a training room kind of guy. <laughs> That's what's up. That's what's up. All right. cool, yeah. So we're gonna go eat now at a place called Little Greek. Freaking sh shiz, guys. New Year's Day, Little Greek's closed. So we went to Chipotle. Chipotle is also closed, come on. I thought chains would be open. It freaking right. sucks, dude. So now, now we're just on the hunt for something. On the hunt. Any suggestions? Not, not, not to, yeah. Chick -fil look at this, uh, look at this curtain that my parents put up in my house that looks like some kind of performance curtain. They said it was to block the cold air from coming here when you open the door. So they built a curtain. Check it out, look, Carla, Mejia, and Annie have come from Houston to Austin to Dallas, and now they're meeting, now they can meet my other friend Nito. I'm about to run out of batteries, about to die. That's pretty cool though, man. Everyone's in Dallas now, and we're all gonna go to my grandparents' house. The big D. <laughs> so we're here at this Thai Japanese, traditional Japanese, classic, traditional, Japanese Mid traditional midnight rolls. Traditional. I'm gonna get. Anyways, we're at this Thai Japanese restaurant with Nino, Carla, and Annie. And see, I'm gonna get that. I just came back from Japan, you know. I need something traditional Japanese. I need a traditional Japanese classic plano midnight roll. roll. Plano roll. Oh, plano roll. Yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm just really missing Japan right now. I, I, I want some of that traditional, you know. Real Japanese feel, yeah. so I think I'm gonna have to go with the Plano. Level. That's right, because that's originally in the Plano Prefecture of Japan. Right? Exactly, but but you but you know what though? I'm actually gonna get the midnight roll. You know, so okay. it's, not, it's it's almost midnight. It's right? Yeah, because it's, it's almost midnight. almost midnight. Authentic Japanese food. You know, midnight roll. Look, just read it. There it is, baby. Look at this. The classic, authentic Japanese food. I mean, we could. The midnight roll. Look at that. Tobiko on top. <laughs> Nino's fucking birthday, dude. It's Nino's birthday today. Turning 21. Got this freaking crazy dragon. <laughs> <laughs> what do you guys like doing it too? They're like laughing and stuff. <laughs> yo, 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 guys. It is December 2nd. <laughs> it is January 2nd, 2015. Holy shit, guys. Two more days until I have to go back to Japan. Dang, man. I'm gonna miss America. But anyways, I'm at this mall called Stonebriar Mall with uh, some of my friends. It's my friend Kartik from high school. Man. Kartik, they got full beard now, dude. This has been crazy. <laughs> and then Carla and Annie are up there scouting ahead, you know, making sure there's no danger. You know what I'm saying? And uh, I'm destroying them. See, I already bought two things. Actually, this one's a present for one of the students, but I'm destroying them. They got nothing. They got nothing so far. Kartik just got here, so it doesn't count, you know? Yeah. He's not losing yet. 
<laughs> no, we're about to get express. Maybe I'll get something. Yeah, yeah. Oh yeah, dude, express. Maybe I'll buy something. I want to buy. What is that? I have a beanie in here. Oh, dude, guys, guys. Wait, can you hold? It? Oh crap! Can you hold one of these bags real quick? So look, I really wanted to buy a beanie like this <laughs> because because in Japan I have like this small normal size beanie and it like only covers half my ears. So when I ride my bike, it's like freezing. But this is gonna cover all my ears. Might even cover my eyes. <laughs> And I want to wear this in the gym when I work out and throw everybody off. He's like, what the fuck? Why is he wearing that <laughs> to the gym? <laughs> so yeah, oh shit. Walking it. What is this store? Express. Oh, Express. In this place called Tivana. You can try out some of their complimentary teas. Right, Karthik? Yeah. Yeah, dude. This is an iced one. I don't, the, the hot <laughs> ones are disgusting. like sour and shit. Did you like the, did you like the hot ones? Yes? Oh, you want like the hot ones? It's disgusting. It's cool. That gingerbread black tea. This is uh, some limeade. It's gingerbread black tea. Is that one hot? It's warm. It's warm. There were two by the entrance and they were both hot as food. I don't know how to say it either. Tivana. Tivana. Land of complimentary tea tasting. That looks like coffee. Oh, but not when you pour it into it. Look at that! merry-go-round. You want to ride on it, Carla? I'll record you. Just like when your parents recorded you when you were a kid riding merry-go-round. <laughs> Just like I rode merry-go-rounds when I was a kid. <laughs> but it never really happened. That actually never happened. Now, I'm at this restaurant. At this restaurant. It's called Mellow Mushroom. Very popular in Austin. And I'm not going to spoil it for you, but they sell pizza. <laughs> It's freaking good, dude. Holy crap, I'm so excited. In Japan, there's like no, there's very, very few pizza restaurants, and then pizza usually sucks, and it's not anything like this pizza. It's gonna be freaking amazing. So, we're here deciding what we're gonna get. I think we're gonna get a, a 10 inch okay. small one okay of a magical mystery tour. Part of it, just do half and then chicken, half chicken. And then a magical mystery tour small and a medium. Half buffalo chicken with no bacon because bacon is disgusting. And half philosopher's pie because I'm a philosopher. <laughs> and then a 14 inch Mellowitarranian. Half of it with no chicken because this guy right here is a vegetarian. I mean, a vegetarian. <laughs> <laughs> Whoops. Alright, guys, so we just ordered. We just ordered. Hey, come on, man. I'll just focus on myself. So we just ordered. We just ordered. Um, I can't pizza. Yeah, we just ordered pizza. <laughs> we just ordered pizzas, okay? And we like customize almost every single one. Like we're like, oh, we want half no chicken, half chicken on the half that does have the chicken, no onions or whatever. And so it's pretty crazy, you know, we can customize it and it's amazing. But in Japan, so well, first of all, in America we have like the saying, and I'm, I'm actually talking to you guys. So in America, yeah. <laughs> we have the saying like the customer is always right, right? But in Japan, they have the saying is the customer is God. Uh, yeah, and so like, yeah, you, what does that mean? like you have to do everything they say. Like, like, and you have to be super polite to them. You know, if they find something wrong with the food, you have to remake it and stuff like that. You know, and you, you just have to act super polite. You know, and um, the thing is, like, even though they're so polite and they're so professional and they, they do stuff efficiently, and they'll redo it if they mess up and blah blah blah, right? And they'll they'll apologize profusely if they mess up, whatever. Like, if you ask them for something as simple as, can you put no chicken on it? They'll be like, oh. I don't know if we can do that. Let me go, I need to ask the manager. Like, uh, even though they'll do everything else for you, you know? They follow instructions. Yeah. They follow instructions like to it. See, they have no idea how to like step out of boundaries and like, yeah. But even if something as simple as like, like if they were to make this pizza and you said, can you just leave the chicken out? Just don't put it on the pizza, right? Yeah. But they'll be like, oh, I don't know if we can do that. Like, I need to go ask the manager. And it's stupid. Yeah, it's weird. Uh, yeah, it's, <laughs> so, it's very refreshing to be back in America and able to customize our food. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, just listen to it again. Carla's an idiot and thought I said, the customer is gone. No. <laughs> Everyone else thought I said, God. The customer is God. <laughs> like religion. That is God with a D, as in dick. No, you mean Dallas? <laughs> as Dallas. in Dallas. God, D as in Dallas. <laughs> Like divine. Yeah. Like divine. <laughs> like <not> God. Dios. <laughs> all, right, all right, guys. Check this shit out, dude. All right, here's the <laughs> half and half buffalo. I forgot the name of it, but it's like a buffalo chicken pizza. And there's the philosopher's pie. 
She has the full mellow terrainian. Look at this shiz. Oh gosh, it looks even better in the camera. And then here, can you bring that one over here? And there's the small. Oh, is it hot? There's the. <laughs> <laughs> There's a small um, mystery tour, magical mystery, mystery yeah. tour. Oh shit! All right, here we go. Thank you, son.